welcome back dear friends inside this lecture we are going to discuss about linear gradients so what is linear gradients i'm just going to show you some example here uh, i'm just going to show you the image you can see this image here we have just a color something like pink and here we have a color by mixing pink and blue it means we have two color purple and pink you can see we have two color mixed just like this so here we have pink pink color is called piglet pink between white so this is called just gradient when you are just going to mix a color between just uh, red and white it can be black and white and it could be green and orange you are just going to mix the color so this is called just gradient here you can see between dark blue and between white so I can just uh, explain it better on just working practical. So we have just a div tag here and you can just open the div here and open curly braces. Here first I am just going to select the width of this to 400 pixel and the height for this to 400 pixel and the background for this something maybe red color and the margin for this to 0 auto. To put this in center save go to your web page and refresh so you can see we have just a different uh, just box by 400 pixel by 400 pixel so I can just use here a border also border just 5 pixel solid uh, let's just use blue border here save and refresh so around the diff we have just used a border so no matter here uh, you can just say background now we are going to use a uh, linear gradient background and you can say just linear make sure l i n e a r and hyphen gradient gradient g r a a d i e n t linear gradient you can just open this to round bracket and semicolon inside this you are giving the starting and the ending point it means you are giving the name of two color the first color name can be the starting point and the second color name can be the ending point for example i'm just writing here red is the starting point of this linear gradient and a comma and the second color for example uh, let's just use the yellow color here this is the ending point linear starting point and linear ending point you can save this go to your web page and you can see it is already refreshed as i told we can mix two color and it will become a gradient now on the top we have a red color and on the bottom we have a yellow color so this is just the default rule for selecting color uh, just as a gradient so you can just uh, change the color for example you can set between blue and yellow save now we have between blue and yellow you can just say this one can be green and this one can be maybe orange color you can save this and refresh between orange and green between just orange and red i know this is just not good but you can apply here between green and red orange and red save and refresh so like this you can just change the color now i'm just going to change uh, tell you how you can change the gradient for example you want from left to right or you want just from bottom to uh, top to bottom bottom to top or right to left just all of this i'm just going to tell you here so first i'm just going to put this to a red and yellow or you can just say white also you can save and you can refresh this one here but i'm just going to put this on yellow color it is more clear yellow save and refresh so now you can see the direction is bottom to left i'm just going to change this from left to right here you can just put a comma 
and here you can just say to right to right save and refresh now you can see how we have the red color to the left and the uh, yellow color to the right why it is here you can see we have red color and you can see you can just uh, you have ordered here to the right it means from the left to the right if you just uh, replace the yellow color here and the red color here so now you can see the color is changed now yellow is here and the red is here you can just say here to the top 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 save and refresh now it is just uh, top to bottom you can just say you can focus here for right now we have the yellow color to the bottom and if I'm just writing here bottom save and refresh now we have yellow color to the top so like this you can just change the position of this gradient instead of this you can set in degree also for example I'm just writing here in 88 deg deg r -E -E, it means degree so you can save this and refresh now it is on just 88 degree and you can use the opposite of this also for example uh, high minus 88 degree so it will come to this side so this just working as a left to right right to left top to bottom bottom to right that we can just write here just like this to left just like this to bottom to top or to left something like this or to right save and refresh so you can see so i hope you are understand what is gradient and how you can use the gradient so you can just apply this on the body also for example uh, i'm just going to remove this div from here there is no div or i'm just going to remove this one from here this div and i have just a container Control c to copy instead of this div i'm just putting this container so just remove the width and height because i have already defined the width and height inside the external style sheet you can see for the container with thousand height also 500 pixel now you can see that we have applied here on the body also you can just set instead of uh, i'm just going to make this comment or just container 2 so you can just select here the body tick instead of this p o d y body you can save and refresh now you can see that i have applied this on the body this gradient but i'm just going to make this container and you can select this dot container you can save and refresh so you can apply this on the body on the div on your container on the header anywhere you want you can use this gradient and this is called linear gradient once again i hope it is clear for you you have learned about gradient so you have enjoyed watching this video till the next class try to watch the video and try to just insert a div insert a body tag inside your css and just apply the same way gradient have a nice time and see you